the hell is wrong with y'all? Have you guys no parental advice? What? Ladies and gentlemen, there's something called an internet footprint in which when you say something, it will last forever on the internet. So why are you guys explaining domestic terrorism what? on simple acts of kindness? Oh. One of these memes said, oh yeah, when the cashier says my order is only 1862, the loaded revolver in my fucking pocket. Why are you going to kill the cashier because they're doing their job? You guys are psychic. And that's what we're talking about today. Yo, what's going on guys? Pymat7 here. We are back at it with our first meme video of the month of May. Now, ladies and gentlemen, yeah, I've been gone for a while, okay? I was working. I was doing a lot of this. You guys know my birthday was May 1st. Yo, I'm just excited to be back, man. We're in yellow. Yellow's my favorite color. I love wearing yellow. I had to do a drip check on you, man. You know what? Drip check. <laughs> Back up, back up, back up, back up. I'm finna overwhelm you niggas with the drip, man. Y'all know how I get down with yellow. Y'all see the pirate shirt? It got my last name on it with a seven. Y'all don't care. So lads, today's meme is called Psychopath Memes. This is something I've been witnessing in the meme game for a while. I have been seeing a bunch of memes of simple situations turning into domestic terrorism and murder. Literally off just normal things. And I've been like, wait a second. Why has this been kind of on the low key? Why has this kind of not been getting in the limelight? Now it's getting the recognition it deserves, okay? And good God, some of you guys need to be locked up for making these memes. These are fucking horrific. Simple situation. You go to GameStop, you ask for Halo 2. The guy says, hey, your card declined, and you fucking blow his head off with a goddamn desert eagle. That's the meme. And they're like, oh, yeah, this is a casual thing. Yeah, I just, I just shoot people, you know, after buying certain things. I just like to kill people. Like, bro, you're a fucking psychopath. You hear me? That's basically the meme, man. And I want to check out if these psychopath memes are actually something that the FBI needs to look into, or if they're just a little funny joke on the internet. But yo, lads, without further ado, let's get into these goddamn memes. Look at this shit. Oh my god. This Thursday feels like a Friday. Haha. -ha. The C4 hidden in my lunchbox. Jesus Christ. What the fuck are you? The terrorist from Counter Strike? What the fuck is going on? This Thursday feels like a Friday, man. Wow. And then there's a C4 in your lunchbox. And I'm assuming you're somewhere you shouldn't be. Real Stiffy, we're watching you. I love his fucking work. Shout out to Real Stiffy. But we're watching you. We know what you're on. You talk about C4s in your lunchbox, nigga. You ain't no damn terrorist. This ain't Black Ops 2. I'm finna go for the Ninja Defuse, nigga. I'll be goddamn. Defusing the bomb. Defusing the bomb. Defusing the bomb. Uh. Yo, shout to hell, young Nick. This man says, oh, Elon bought Twitter. That's crazy. But have you considered the fact that I just implanted 200 African fire ants behind your eyes? Now hurry what? and dig out your eyeballs before they get you. Hurry and dig them out. Dig out your eyeballs now. Jesus fucking Christ. What the hell has meme culture turned into? Now we talk about mind manipulation, mind manipulation to the point where you're saying that there are fire ants behind your fucking eye sockets and he wants you to dig out your fucking eyes. What the hell is this? We ain't in Naruto, okay? I ain't finna get no Rin Shinigami all that other shit. I don't really watch Naruto. I don't really know what most of that shit is. But I know they be popping their eyes out like they fucking quarters and shit. Talk about some fire ants. <laughs> dig by my Jesus Christ. Me listening to the waiter tell me they are out of barbecue sauce knowing damn well that the C4 strapped to my chest is about to go off in 5.3 seconds. Why? Why, man? They didn't deserve to get blown up for telling you, hey, sir, we're out of barbecue sauce and it fucking explodes. Have some consideration about your fellow American. You're a goddamn terrorist. Jesus Christ, you guys are worse than the fucking opening of Piccadilly. That's a little throwback reference to Modern Warfare 2019. You guys remember? Uh, no. Modern Warfare, he got out the truck and blew himself up. Y'all don't remember that. I need y'all to start playing Call of Duty more. The IRS, you're $236,000 in debt. How the fuck? How are you gonna pay it off? The fully loaded AK-47 in my backpack. Is that Kevin Durant? Get that fucking fraud off my goddamn screen. Don't you ever compare this nigga to LeBron James again. But also, what do you mean, bro? You think that AK-47 is just gonna fix all that debt? And you're going out the easy way. You're going out the easy way with the AK-47. Nigga, you not in Black Ops 1. You wanna sit your ass down, handle your business, and Get your money right now. I don't know how the hell you got $260,000 of debt, but that's on you, player. That's on you. Do better. <laughs> you are sentenced to watching anime memes for fun. Did he just try to kill himself? Holy shit. 
Holy shit. I can't even hold you. I can't even blame dude. Anime memes are so ass, bro. They're so weeby, bro. I be like, bro, this is not funny. I'm a little anime girl. Am I not funny? No. You're not funny. You're not funny. You put a little fucking image of this little anime girl. You put some text on it. And you think you're funny. Bro, no. You're a Redditor. You're a weeb. Go outside. Them shits is not funny. That'd be $60 to renew your fishing license, sir. Me. Oh my god, bro. That lady ain't do- This nigga's a criminal. This guy's a psychopath of them all. He's hopping through a glass window. She's trying to- Oh man, she's done. She's a young lady, you know what I'm saying? She wasn't really prepared for that situation. But if I was there, as soon as that nigga fucking punched the window and that shit cracked, I would've been squaring up. I said, oh, it's game time, nigga. It's life or death in this situation. That nigga punched the glass one time and it cracked. You doing all this for a fishing license, nigga? Get up. Let's go. Nigga. <laughs> you are watching a master at work. But listen, lads, yo, that's all the memes we got, man. These are actually really funny, and I think they're more of jokes than, like, actual domestic terrorism. I think it's a little funny meme. It shows, like, a little psychopath version of him, and I don't think people should take him too serious. And I give this meme an 8 out of 10. I fucking love it. I really love this meme. This shit was actually really funny. But yeah, lads, I hope you boys enjoyed the video. Drop a like on this, and man, I will see you boys in the next one, alright? Now put your fucking hands up.